Hello to all. Uh, welcome to Global Offensive Hacker Associate Community. In this particular section, we are going to learn about course vulnerability, and I'm going to teach you how we can identify a course vulnerability on the live application. So stay with me. You can do this particular episode, and I'm going to teach you how we can configure it and how we can identify this issue for the particular live application. So let's understand what is course. So I already have a recorded okay the particular video which is available on YouTube. You can simple go ahead and you can check on the particular i button and you can simple learn okay the particular course basics. So course stand for cross origin resource sharing and generally when you try to exploit uh, regarding to the course you always look for the response header right like access control allow origin or access control allow credential. So we always check this two particular header in the responses side and based on this okay we are just try to exploit the things. So we need to check okay first it is vulnerable and based on the vulnerability only we can exploit it. So it is short video and I'm going to teach you how we can detect it. So let's start it. And before starting anything okay like I'm just giving you some pages which you need to follow for a more update or for a more thing like if you want to download the cheat sheet if you want to download some material if you want to download some tools so you can see on my right hand side you can see that the linkedin account you can simple follow here just click on the linkedin button and you will be redirect okay to this page and you can download all the material from here okay and daily basis i am sharing the cheat sheet the material the screenshot the videos and many other things i am sharing under this particular section so like example let's say you can see this is the accesses exploitation you can see that here i already shared the payload same way you can if you navigate to this particular page you will be able to identify a lot of interesting detail here next you can uh, follow this twitter account so it's simple just go there and here you will find a lot of interesting uh, framework like ssrf uh, framework for ssrf related okay issues second you can see uh, i have shared okay this blue hound uh, the next if you can see the mobile app and testing and lot of interesting material will be available okay, under this account so just monitor this account okay and uh, follow it for more update and every day we are coming with the interesting topic let us start with the today topic so we'll be focusing on a course issue like how we can detect a course vulnerability or how we can identify course issue on the live application so how we can do that so i am using a, a framework called Coursey so you can simple go ahead and you can just type here Coursey and simple just type github okay and then simple just go to this particular link you open it up after that you can simple go to uh, this one code and git clone it right so i'll just open my terminal which is here and let me just zoom the terminal for you so i'll just go to my opt directory ls and then i'll go to the web pen test and then ls and here you can see i just already uh, clone this particular repository you can simple clone it you can go to this course C and first time okay you are configuring you can simple give ch mod permission and you can simple just type star okay after that just like this ch mod plus x star enter the part password and once you are done with this particular thing you can simple see that everything under the red color and you simply as pip3 install minus r requirement dot txt that's it once you're done with this particular section you can simple start your framework to check how to check simple just say python 3 course uh, py minus h and you can clearly see that here is started now you require some kind of uh, basically a url in order to test it so i'm going to show you one vulnerable thing and i'm going to show you one live application okay but i'm going to hide the url because it is not in our scope okay so this is a live target which i'm going to test and before this i'm going to show you how it look like so python 3 i'm going to use it and then courses.py for url you can use minus u and then you can add the url like this https or http you can simple just type zero whatever the application you want to assess you simple just type like this okay and then enter if everything okay you will see that here the output so it will tell you this is particular uh, this particular application is vulnerable or not vulnerable so you can clearly see that okay we have this application which we tested and class wildcard value uh, description this host allow requests made from any origin however the browser will block all the requests to this host by default severity low and not possible to exploit and here is basically called acao basically 
एक्जेस कंट्रोल अलाउ ओरिजिन एंड यू कैन सी हेयर ओके वी एव स्टार सो दिस इज नॉट एक्सप्लोटेबल ओके बट नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू वन लाइव एप्लीकेशन विच आई एम गोइंग टू हाइड द यू आर एल ओके बिकॉज आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू शो कास्ट बिकॉज अदरवाइज पीपल माइट दे आर एबल टू एक्सप्लॉट इट ओके वी डोंट वॉन्ट टू शो दैट तो जस्ट ओके फॉर द नॉलेज पर्पज आई एम गोइंग टू टेक वन लाइव एंड पॉइंट आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू ओके द लाइव एप्लीकेशन सो लेट्स एडिट दिस पर्टिकुलर थिंग एंड वी हैव एस टी टी पी एस यू आर एल सो जस्ट टाइप हियर and then i'm going to add this url and here you can see that so first i'm going to show you one endpoint you can clearly see that how it look like and here you go so you can see there is no misconfiguration found but if i add another url with the same domain and you can clearly see that it is vulnerable and the severity is high and you can clearly see that uh, the class origin reflected and this host allow any origin to make request to it severity is high and this is completely exploitable you identify one header call access control allow origin header and you can see is reflected and you can see is true it means access control allow credential okay this two header is very very important when you trying codes related okay issue and here okay you see that it is true it means it is exploitable okay so this is the short video that's how we can de detect the particular vulnerability in the next case okay we are going to exploit it for more information like this and if you want to learn advanced application pen testing in detail then this is the course for you awpt you can simply go ahead and you can check all the module will be covering everything in detail and is completely a black hat stuff where okay you able to bypass mfa subdomain takeover all injection accesses and web bypass and many 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 things okay we are going to learn okay under this program I hope this video is informative for you thank you for watching the video have a great day ahead see you soon in the next episode